What's up guys, Rich at Rivera Urban Homestead. Say hi, Tyler. Hi. Right now, Tyler is filling up that little tray right there with some raised, a bag of raised bed soil I had sitting around the corner here. I felt like growing something, so what I'm gonna do, I looked through my seed packs in my ammo can and I found cilantro, oregano, garlic chives, and regular chives. So we're gonna plant that stuff in there, see how it goes. Kind of like a little herb bed, if you would. All right, keep shoveling it. We gotta fill it up. Gonna add a little bit of kelp meal in there along with some blood meal. Good nitrogen. Be good for the leafy herbs. Okay, Bubba, now pour the fertilizer in there. Spread it around. All right, and then now I'll just work it in. And again, that's just kelp meal and a little bit of blood meal. Give it a little more nitrogen. Okay. So now that's ready to be planted. Right, so here are the seed packets I found in my can. Some oregano, cilantro, garlic chives, and some other chives. So that's what we're using. We're just going to space it out and see what happens. Okay, so here we go. I made three little divots. Right there, right there, right there. That's going to be the oregano. Right here is going to be the cilantro and those three divots. And then a line of chives and a line of chives. Let's see how it goes. They're so small. You see how small those are? Whoa. Let me see. Hold on. Look at them little, little guys. Okay, they're almost like beta food. Okay, now look. Just a little pinch and put it right in that hole. Just a little pinch. Okay, and then grab another little pinch and put it in that hole. Oh my god, it's you. That's fine, put them in there. You need more than a couple. Put a pinch in there. Put a couple more in there. Okay. Put them in that area. Just kind of put them in that area. That's good. Alright. Watch out. We'll just cover that up like that. Okay, let's get the other one. That was the it oregano. Seems. This one is the cilantro. Yes, those are a little bit bigger. Look at the size of them guys. Let me see them. Good job. Okay, so put two in each hole. One. Two. Okay, next hole. One. Two, good job, and then the other two in that hole. One, two, and now just rub your hand over the soil and cover them up. That's it, good job, buddy. Okay, let's go to the chives now. This is just the regular chives. Whoa, that's probably a little too much. All right, come here now. Now, over here, where you see this end indent, just kind of sprinkle them inside of there and keep moving your hand across. Keep moving it across and sprinkle them in there. More, more movement like this, look. Watch, ready? Just sprinkle and move. Over here, more over here, no more over there. Good job. Okay, you know what? That's probably enough. Put a couple more in there, but we'll put the rest back in. Or actually, we'll throw the rest in the flower bed. Okay, now throw those in there. Maybe we'll get some wild ones growing. Come on, we gotta go eat. Mama's calling us. Move all the way down. Good job, all the way down the row. More down this way. Yeah, put the rest down there. Put those two. Right. Only one. All right. And two. And that's it, guys. All right, we gotta go eat. We'll water it in, put it out by the patio. All right, so that's where I'm gonna position it, kinda of out of the way, right on the side of the patio, right by the garden, so it'll get some good sun. Water it down real good, get it nice and wet. And then we'll monitor it. And that's it. So Tyler just helped me do this mini herb bed. All right, guys, so that was really cool, just spur of the moment kind of thing, I figured. I want to plant something, 
I want to start using some of these little pots I have around here and maybe just adding some stuff on to the garden not necessarily in those raised beds but in different pots around the area herbs and different things like that maybe some lettuces so just a new twist on things so Tyler came out and he helped me which was awesome and we had a good time and there it is it's gonna be right there just chilling hopefully it gets enough Sun there if it doesn't we can move it that's the great thing about those little portable pots so anyway hope you guys enjoyed it a little Monday night edition I guess I'm getting ready to go watch the Tampa Bay Lightning game and y'all have the rest of the week have a good one thanks